Throw your motherfucking hands up. What's going on YouTube? It's Paradox here with another video and I really have to talk about this. This is why you're seeing my face because I've been doing a lot of stuff just behind gameplay recently but you haven't seen my face in a while so you know why not. Anyway as I hit the printer next to me whatever besides the point. So we received information today that heists for Grand Theft Auto Online have been delayed once again and I have to talk about this right because I go to the comments section. I go to the comments section like I always do. I just read. I really backed away from being active in comment sections now. So I'm just reading. I'm reading. I'm seeing like I'm trading in my copy of GTA 5. Class action lawsuit against Rockstar. They're lying to us. They're lying to us. Hurry up. They're just delaying it for next gen PC release. They're being lazy. Blah, 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 blah. They've had about a year. Get it out. Hurry up or else I'm going to sell my game. Do you want my game? Blah, 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 Grand Theft Auto 5 wasn't even that good. All this hate, right? So you see all this hate, and the Shaunas did a video kind of on the same thing I'm about to touch on yesterday. Link to his channel will be down in the description just in case you missed that video. But I'm sick and tired of all the hate in the Grand Theft Auto community, in the GTA community as a whole, and it just makes me not want to play GTA 5 to begin with. Now, the first thing, I don't even play GTA 5 that much. I haven't played it much for months now because I'm not very big on Grand Theft Auto in general, right? I'm not the person like, oh, I have to play GTA. I have to get it as soon as it comes out, this, that, and the other, right? Because I know GTA is going to be there for years. It's going to be there for a long time. GTA 4 came out, what, 2008? And we just got GTA 5 in 2013, right? I didn't get GTA 4 until this edition came out the complete edition this is when i got gta 4 it was 2011 or 2012 that's when i got gta 4 because it wasn't a necessary thing for me i can wait because these games are going to be around for a long time people jeez if Rockstar has proven one thing is that they support their games. So for you to just get this mad and upset about a feature that's coming to a game that's going to be around for, for like five more years is just ridiculous. Grow up. Seriously, Rockstar has proven time and time again that they, one, make great games. Two, they are perfectionists. They're not going to put out a broken product, right? Obviously, people are going to say, well, Grand Theft Auto Online was broken. All right. Whatever, but rock, the people at Rockstar are perfectionists. And if you want this feature, give them the time that they need to perfect this. Then, when it comes around, finally, it was supposed to be out in the spring. When it comes around, finally, you will be happy. And you'll be able to say, hey, I'm glad I waited for this. You know, just stop being so impatient about everything. And while I'm on this little tangent, like... I, the reason I don't really play Grand Theft Auto Online is because of the community, right? It's the hate, and then it's just the people who just kill you for no reason at all. I decided to get on yesterday, right? They released the I'm Not a Hipster pack. So I just was like, okay, I want to see some of the new clothes. I want to see the new cars. Hadn't been on since the High Life update. I want to see what they included in that, too. So I'm just minding my own business, you know, driving my car to the store. I come out of the store boom 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 dead and i just immediately get off there was no reason for that person to kill me right no reason at all i was minding my own business i didn't mess with anyone in the game i just simply went to the store did what i had to do come out and i die right so for all of you that continue to play grand theft auto 5 for all the people that continue to play grand theft auto 4 all this what is the purpose of that? Seriously, I have no idea. Why do you find the urge to just kill people for no reason? Why is that funny to you? One, it's just stupid. Honestly, I just think it's stupid. But the main thing here is heists are coming to GTA 5, right? So if you want to sell your copy now just because they're not there right now, I think that's stupid. But... You do with your money what you want to do with your money, all right? For all the people that bought this game at launch, I got the game at launch. I can wait for Heist. I can wait. I'm not going to buy it on PS4 and Xbox One the day it comes out. I'm going to probably wait a couple months to get it at a discount. I don't really care, right? 
I just want to know, why is there so much hate in the Grand Theft Auto community? Why do you guys just continue to hate and bash everything? A new update will come out. Oh, it's not heist. You get multiple apartments. It's not heist. New cars. It's not heist. Appreciate Rockstar for what they give you and give them the time to give you what you want. If you want Heist to be the best that they can be, you will trust in these developers. And you will wait. Anyway, that's the end of this video. What do you guys think about all this hate in the Grand Theft Auto community? Do you want Heist in Grand Theft Auto 5? What platform do you have or will get Grand Theft Auto 5 on if you're going to get it at all? What do you think of Rockstar in general? Those are my questions. You know how I feel. I'm Paradox, and I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.